Get him. Come on, Rick. There we go. This is for seat extension mount for Tina. Excuse the messy street truck action, but we're going to extend from here down to here so the seat can be moved forward safely where she can drive it. Whoops, there goes the light. What do you think, Bart? I'm gonna have to come down in the front a little bit. Pretty close. Don't you be measuring twice. Just measure once and cut it twice. Uh. That way it's still too short. Mm-hmm. Cut it two times and it's still too short. So I guess we'll cut it again. One of the upgrades I'm doing this winter. Should have already done it, but running out of time. I'm going to head and upgrade it to the Ampi FI IGN-1A coils. Give this thing a little more snap. I was having a problem at the end of the year with it. Kind of laying over it towards the end of the pass and was down about 10 mile an hour it's only going like buck 35 138 somewhere in there and looked at all the data and we determined that these stock truck coils at 13 maybe 1400 horsepower at the tire is not going to do it any longer maybe it's because they got 200 thousand miles on them i don't know but finally ponied up and bought some of these coils so we'll see what happens with this and uh maybe tina can tell me how it goes okay <laughs> truck capital come on bart Have you seen some of my welds? <laughs> you gonna leave it tacked or? I mean, I'm worried about all these other tacks knocking in those. Okay. You wanna kind of hop in here and see where you wanna get it. You wanna put that in? Yeah, That's all right, you don't have to go away on. Okay, so got her fitted. I feel like it's going to be good to go. So we'll get the seat bolted in and braced up and safe. And Tina will have her a nice, new, comfy <laughs> office. She'll see what Old Blue's all about. Mm-hmm. So we're finally headed to the racetrack. Finally, finally, finally. So we're gonna go test today. I will be driving David's truck today. Have the whole family in here. So we are ready to go, loaded, ready to go racing. Hopefully it'll be a good day. Yes. Proceed please. This one got my debit card, I need to. I need to sign. Almost, almost ready. Paying our fee so we can get in.
Okay, we made two passes in this thing. First one was really good. It wasn't very fast but uh, we were just making sure everything was right and everything was going. So, and I got all my jitters out of the way. I usually have to make a couple of passes in a new vehicle just to get my routine down and make sure everything is right. So, hopefully we're good. This last pass that we made, it didn't shift, so I had to manually shift it, so it threw our times off a little bit, but still, it wasn't bad. So, hopefully this next pass, we can get a good run with it. Uh, appears to be everything running good. Just I need to get my stuff together and hopefully we'll make a good pass this time. Up to the lanes? Yeah. Good nice down. about that fast, huh? a couple passes uh boost controller wasn't doing what it was supposed to do the ramp was really slow even though i was kept turning the ramp up so we had a wastegate leaking luckily i had some parts so we put a new diaphragm in there so now not knowing what it's going to do well tina you better hold on so we'll see what it's going to do right here track should be good it's probably going to wheelie a little bit we'll see what happens <laughs>
day at the track today. We made probably, say about six passes. First pass was pretty good. Uh, that was just like a make sure everything's set and ready. And so the second pass was where we turned it up a little bit and we had some uh, shifting issues. And then uh, went back out there. We made <clears throat> three more passes and they all went for relatively okay. But we did get a couple of, uh, the last two had pretty bad tire shake. It was pretty rough, but you know, stayed in it and it cleared up, made a pass. Still wasn't really fast, but all in all, it did pretty well. We probably need to freshen up this engine and the things that we got going on with it. But for the most part, we did great. David's truck did awesome. Just me trying to figure out what to do and, and my routine inside his truck. So it's a little different than mine, but pretty close to being the same. So, but a good successful day at the track. So hopefully next weekend, maybe the weekend after we'll get out and do some more testing and get ready for race season. So hopefully we'll have a good one this year.